Hey there, Julian here, and I'm gonna show you how to use the CountUp.js plugin in DivHunt. So this one is super easy, let's get started. First thing you're gonna to wanna to do is select your text, paragraph, header, whatever it may be, and add however many spans you need. So in this case, we have something, then the count up, and then something after that. So we're gonna need three. So let's change our content. What we're gonna to wanna to do is over 2 million chocolates. So let's do that. Beautiful, and chocolates. Beautiful, again. And with this, I am going to want to set this to a block so I can have it show up under. There we go. So now we have that, and the next thing we're gonna need to do is go to the settings, go to plugins, and just click install on CountUp.js. I've already done that, it's one button. Once you've done that, go right back to the builder. Then you're going to want to select that span with the number on it. Go over here, go to transform, click that and do count up. So as you can see, it's done, but we have some settings. Let's go ahead and set those. Let's go with four setting, uh, four seconds. Sorry. So there we go. Separator. This is already set here. I can do whatever I want. Let's bring it back to comma because I am from North America. And then prefix I don't need in this case, but you can do let's say a value like dollars, go ahead, do a suffix. Again, we don't need those. You can make that whatever you want. You can have a whole word. There you go. And yeah, this also will set it to be whether it's on view or on load. So if it's below the fold, you're probably gonna want it to be on view. Otherwise people just won't notice it. So. Yeah, with that set up, let's go ahead and check out our site, see what it looks like. Beautiful. Exactly what I want. So yeah, that's it. Hope you enjoyed and talk to you soon.